I'm okay. calling security. Oh, I gotta get security. I was expecting you to say the little one would start barking. The guys. It's like, oh hey, it's a little dog barking. No big deal. Then a big boofer comes out. Okay, so yeah, no, they would, they would walk and off cows. and come back with them. I think the Tibetans are the super fluff. Fl super fluffy, big, and they're they are vicious. They are vicious biggers. Oh yeah, it. A lot of them have kind of like a Rottweiler color pattern to them. Yep. Yeah, it's there like, you go. It's like, they're oh, like, cute. like somebody breaks into a Tibetan monastery. They're just like, they're you like, what you... it, an oh, actual what you... lion of a dog. It's like, oh, what yeah. are you going to do, little dog? Nothing, but he will. A lion that freaking looks more like a lion. Holy crap, what's that doing in here? <laughs> I think I'm either a very large dog or a very small bear. And I don't know how to find out which. The funny well, thing is, when Mastiffs, the breed, was invented, the first one that the guy bred, that he was like, this is the design I'm looking for, they actually did name that dog Lion. And yep. if you live with English Mastiffs, they have a lion-like shape to their body. That is true. Like, that was the goal. Well, it's that been fun, guys, true. but I'm going to hit the hay. All right, Vlad. Okay, Vlad. It's been a ton Have of fun. fun. I'm going to probably not going to be on at all tomorrow because I've got family here. We're going to go do an escape room. It's going to be lit. Oh, that'll be fun. Oh, enjoy. Have fun, dude. Too bad I'm stupid and I can't figure stuff out. <laughs> well, listen to what everyone else says then. I don't know how to problem solve. <laughs> Can I hit it? No? Okay, I don't know what to do then. I would say Snoopy <laughs> is probably your best bet More here. Fries on there, Brett, if you can have some. Alright, thank you. I ate, like, two big handfuls while cooking. <laughs> yeah, she I has- remember. she can make some killer fries. Ooh. Ooh Step in line, Jack in the Box. You have a competitor. <laughs> I do love uh, fucking homemade fries. They're the best. Homemade Same. fries can be so amazing. Yep. In fact, I'm gonna the, go get myself some. The season ones aren't even that bad, but like the regular ones, like the ones that I use for fucking chili fries and shit. Oh, oh, mm. chili fries. That sounds delish. I haven't had chili fries in a while. I need to remember that next time. I actually it's... have some chili. All right, you ready? I'm gonna tell you the secret recipe. You ready for this? All right, it's mm -hmm. it's chili and it's mm -hmm. fries and occasionally oh. cheese. Literally, that's it. <laughs> Oh, oh, chili cool. cheese fries. I was thinking you like, you season them with chili powder. I'm like, what's so special? Oh, I get no. it now. I get it. <laughs> oh. It has my state dish, and it comes with the serving utensil of a French fry, of what's many, whole... many French fries. Because it's you say, because you say state dish. What's what's the whole Texan thing with chili that it's not supposed to have something? Everywhere else okay. makes it with that. Beans? Beans. Uh, yeah. I personally don't see the fucking deal with it. Thanks. Yeah, up Beans here are in, Because the reason I believe, or at least I'm pretty sure the reason that people started using fucking beans in chili is because beans are very filling. And sometimes and have, you, sometimes yeah. you don't, don't like gotta have beans in my chili. Meat. Yeah, yeah. They, because the fact beans, especially like kidney beans, are known for having high protein. They oh, use, absolutely. So, they use those for to put those as like a good substitute, especially for people who are vegetarian. Personally, well, I an iron. <laughs> I mean, yeah, no, fucking, I don't really give a shit if my chili has beans or not. I think the beans okay. add a nice texture to them. I agree. But aside from that, I don't really give a shit. All right, so it looks I like I got everything set. I would love to make set. my family's chili for you and see what you think. So okay. I got a flower pot, sunflower, kernel pulp, tall nut, pumpkin. Umbrella Leaf, Cherry Bomb, and Snoopy. Yeah, that sounds about All right. right. Let's rock. That I'll sounds fairly solid. Uh, the ones that you want to put the Umbrella Leaf in, mm -hmm. you want to put them in... All right, so you want to put it from the second row from the top immediately after the Sunflower, and then the second row from the bottom immediately after the sunflower because that will like maximize the range that it'll cover okay so like you set the second row for uh the umbrella yeah right here no to the right second one from the top right after the sunflower where so do you put the sunflower brett second one from the top brett god damn it brett <laughs> 
You oh, fucking no. simpleton! <laughs> oh no! I'm giving you very concise instruct. There! That's where it goes, but now you have to prioritize on the zombie who's already made his way halfway up. God damn it, Brett! What's wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> These are very simple instructions! <laughs> oh my god. Ooh, what I normally like to do with chili, just to get back on it, is I would get Fritos and put them, Ugh. like, put the Fritos in a bowl, put the chili on top of the Fritos, uh, cook it all up. the Frito fry, you're not special for thinking of it. No. That's... I was thinking of, like, a Frito, yeah, the Frito pie, but I also like, um, okay. um, trying to think Nuts, of what else pumpkin, I normally would put. Cherry bomb. It's, it's called a Frito pie. Again. Well, yeah. But I like to do that along with adding, like, um, putting it with some kind of barbecue. Like ribs. Ooh. <laughs> Get some barbecue ribs. Okay. Okay, just prioritize on putting down the sunflowers for now. Yeah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Poor God. Just. Just put the sunflowers in, because the more sunflowers you have, the more constantly you're generating power, which is the key here. Uh, wait, All right, hold up, hold up. Get the kernel. There you go. Put that shit in there. There you go. Now there you're cooking. Go. Now you're <laughs> cooking with peanut oil. <laughs> oh, God. Hmm. Oh, one more sun, and there. Come on, one more sun. Thank you. You're gonna have to re You're gonna have to relocate that uh kernel pult soon, but not. It's not, not right an now. immediate issue. All right. Mm -hmm. I would move that one directly one square up. Right here. Yeah. All right. Yeah, put it right there. And then where that first one is, I would replace put it with the uh... with the umbrella. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Because the umbrella leaf protects so, all the so squares. around that area. Yeah. So those top three squares, it'll be protected from bungee jumpers and give the, uh, me oh, more there. sun power. Thank you. Uh, too late. Fuck. That's yeah, fine. If it's coming into your lane, you can throw another one on the back lane. If it... I might have to use a cherry bomb. Yeah. Probably. There. Boom. Also, you got zombies coming up your front lane, and I would yeah, take... Yeah, I... Come on, come on. Ugh, shit. One more sun. Come on. Oh, Thank I you. just realized this is a conehead zombie, too. Yeah, I saw it, too. Shit. Well, this well, ain't hopefully good. Hopefully he gets a lot of butter, because the RNG can... The RNG for the butter is actually pretty fucking generous, in my opinion. Yeah. Well, put another one down. There you go. Whoops. Did that just bounce off? No, I don't think so. Oh, it's just... <laughs> Ugh, fuck. God damn it. You're probably gonna have to... Oh, okay. Well... Wait. Ah, oh, damn it. Hang on. There. Phew. Yeah, I would start trying to cover those lanes as, as soon as possible. Like right now, for instance. Yeah, because they're starting to get really crazy now. Oh. I would just... Honestly, there's no shame in just throwing a tall nut down for the time being if you need it. Ah, damn it. All right, wait, wait. Uh, there. That'll hold that one up, considering it's got the, um... The cone. Yeah. Remember, you can put the pumpkin down on existing plants to protect them. Yeah. yeah. take care of that. I was gonna say the one with the fucking cone head directly in front of it, but that works too, Shit. I guess. Putting it on the tall nuts is usually just for meme strategy. No, wait. Yeah, come on. Have returned. 
And there we go again. There. This is off to a very hard start. This is a rough ass start. No! Rough ass. Rough ass. <laughs> Me and Mitch were thinking the same thing. <laughs> I think this row... Also, yeah, Brett, um, there's one that's been eating the fucking pumpkin for like the past five minutes and he has gone unchallenged. Oh, the pumpkin's gone? Yeah, the pumpkin's... Oh, I don't have yeah, enough. there's no defense in that row. But then there's two coming for that sunflower. I would just let the fucking... But the roof cleaner will get them. I will just say, yeah, let the fucking roof cleaner do its job and focus on the other fucking rows. Because trying to salvage that row is just going to dedicate a lot more time and resources. Ooh, this might get interesting. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. By yeah. interesting, I mean fucked. I mean... <laughs> nope, nope, now I'm fucked. Need some immediate defense, no, man. No, no. You see, my genius strategy is now employed. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I see. They can't get you with the basketball <laughs> because of my genius placement of the umbrella leaf. Now yeah, you there's only my one guy shooting basketball, so there's others coming to kill stuff. I mean, yeah, but still, my vast intellect is now in play. Okay. Oh, I'm glad you feel validated. Mind size mega, anyways. I warmed up some leftover pizza, so I'm happy. There we go, there we go. Rosario, don't worry about it. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. There's too many. I need enough sun power in order to set a cherry bomb. No! Damn it! Ah. There it goes. Once they take it out, you can... Oh, okay. Or not. Damn it! You gotta be on the draw with these, my man. Oh. <laughs> I forgot the Zamboni guy has oh, limited shit. ammo. When he runs out of fucking ammo, he'll just drive right up like an asshole. Oh, fuck! Gotta, well, at least it's a Zamboni. Or the basketball throw, or whatever it's fucking name yeah. is. Yeah! Man, this is a rough level. Yes, it is. Y you think? I am- <laughs> I'm too fucked. Yeah. You gotta prioritize- you gotta work on your priorities, man. <laughs> this- that's the whole key to this game, is you gotta micromanage your priorities. <sighs> Basically, the prime strategy is to have as many projectiles going down as many lanes as often as possible. With means Where's to the keep umbrella? them from getting cl close to those projectile throwers. So, offense mm -hmm. over defense. Well, no, you should still have some semblance of defense, but... Well, yes, you need defense, but offense over defense. I mean, mm -hmm. yeah, kind of. Okay. <laughs> Basically, you want your fucking... I mean, yeah, offense over defense, I guess, would be the best yeah, way to... Yeah, a, a stronger Basically... <laughs> offense gives your defense better chance. Mm-hmm. Didn't they say that the greatest offense is a good defense? Yes. But yeah, but in this case, your defense isn't going to kill offense. your problem. Your yeah, offense yeah. will. See, unlike... See, the, the thing is, the best offense is a good defense only applies to uh, living creatures because they get tired. These are zombies, and they don't. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So if you have a good defense, they'll eat through your defense and keep coming. If you kill These them, all, however... Offense. I mean... I'm just saying, if it's dead... It can't cause any damage to your defenses. True. Is the garlic even needed? Honestly, I didn't bother using it. Okay. Yeah, nah. I, I, I didn't see a fucking... A useful purpose for it, like... At all. You eat it. I mean, yeah, but in the context of this game... Take it out of the game and eat it. Well, Rosaria is suggesting the chili. The jalapeno. I mean, the chili, or yeah, the chili isn't bad. It's just sometimes. Well, it go. It only takes out one row. That's the thing. Yeah. It is very useful if you come up against a row that has like a bunch of really tough zombies and you just don't want to fucking deal with them. But at the same time, if there's trouble in an adjacent row, here's, you have to. Here's put a better it in question. Um. 
do they take effect with the big machine guys? Yes, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it just kills everything in that row. So. All right then. Yeah. Fuck it, chili and cherry bomb. We'll see how this goes. All right. Double bombs. Double the explosion. Oof. Are you seeing this? Double your fun. Looking balls. I most certainly am. Otherwise, this would be kind of awkward if I were, <laughs> I don't know, viewing this just, with something like my testicles. Just a blind <laughs> advising. No, don't totally worry, can't I just see this at my, all. I slap my nuts on the screen. That's how I'm seeing what's going on. I'm not using it's like braille. <laughs> And here comes a row. Well, not a row, a, a, a zombie. Come on, load I mean, up. I've heard they were sensitive, but so sensitive you can see what's happening on the screen through them. Oh my god, that's a whole nother level. Yes. <laughs> Nut game strong. <laughs> Good god. Okay. Come on, give me one more. Uno mas. There. Oh, isn't that convenient? There's another zombie in the same in the row. the same row, person. yeah. <laughs> also, one thing that you might consider, getting the rake from Crazy Dave's shop. Okay. Because the rake just, it doesn't do anything aside from buy you a couple of extra seconds, but it's almost guaranteed to always start on the same row that a zombie is coming down, so you just don't have to worry about it, so you can prioritize more on sunflowers and building up power. Hmm. Mm -hmm. It sounds handy. It is very handy. Let me know if anyone can hear my gross eating noises and I'll mute. <laughs> Alright. I warmed up pizza. pizza. I am consuming conch. I noticed, darling. Son of a bitch. Come on, one more. No, two more. Dos mas. There. Dos mas. There we go. There, give it some time. And here comes more. Well, you've got them on every row now. The only one you should be worried about is, well, the one right that in front one. of you. Yeah. Wait, hang the one on. With the calm. There. Oh. Oh, that. Mm. He was just off screen, so it didn't count. Fuck off. Aww. <laughs> Alright, well, done. this would be a good time to Those use. Those work well this. during the, the big wave of zombies, though, at the end. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think, honestly, these guys will. The chili peppers might be better for taking out the, uh, the fucking the cherry. basketball thrower guys. Yeah, yeah. that would have. Yeah. I can see why Rosaria was suggesting it a lot. Alright. Yeah. Oh, damn it, I misplanted <sighs> that. Come on, load, you son of a bitch. Thank you. And boom. I would now start trying to prioritize getting at least two per lane. Mm -hmm. uh, the Colonel Pult's Yes. Get, right. Again, as many projectiles as you can feasibly manage. Exactly. Even you projectiles that you manage? can't... Even projectiles that you can't feasibly manage. Get those two. Very important. Mm -hmm. One more and then I can put the kernel on that one. Thank you. You're getting close to your first wave. Shit. Once you get rid of this guy, it should be a wave, so I would start trying to prioritize either getting more projectiles going or getting some barriers up. Yeah. If only the thing would go faster. Alright, so the only one that is currently without a... Uh, a wall is the, the bottom second row. bottom. Oh, it's... shit. Wait. No, he's safe from a bungee because he has... Ha -ha. Shucks on you, fucker. 
<laughs> All right, one more sun, and damn it, I have to wait on that one. Come I on. would put another uh, Colonel Polt down there in the meantime. Yeah. Mm. There. Yeah. All right. Boom. <laughs> We'll make you a zombie defense agent in no time. Oh my god, it's past midnight where I am. Join Actually, the club. Where, where everyone but Golden is, yeah. Hmm. In there. the cool time zone. <laughs> cool time zone. Oh, here comes those guys. Um, you're, you're good, then. Honestly, I think the colonel, the colonel pulse can take them out so long as they're in the front. But I yeah. would still try to focus on trying to get more colonel pulse out there. All right. All right, guys. There, I got three in the middle row. <laughs> oh, let's put one of the pumpkins on these guys. Oh, uh, shit. Uh, don't worry about it too much. Ha! All right, there cool, cool. Yep. You the ladder, it. I believe, goes down on its own eventually, or it can also be blown up. So. All right. Flower pot, kernel, there. Ha <laughs> ha! Jock's on you, motherfuckers. The egg is on your face. Yeah, There's the shoes egg. on the other foot. How do you like them apples? There's no egg on I only there, got Jason. one foot. That's butter. <laughs> Why? <laughs> because there's butter on their faces. <laughs> that, that wasn't what I was asking, oh. but okay. That oh, was a great sorry. explosion. Yep. What, were you asking why I only had one foot? Yes. It's none of your business. Understandable. <laughs> the other foot had the shoe on it. Now it's gone. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Life is unexpected. Life is unexpected. Expect the unexpected. Full of unexpected problems. <laughs> and that's really the problem here, isn't it? Hmm. Oh, shit. You got it going. It's okay. You're gonna win. If you want to yeah. take out that ladder, I would suggest putting a cherry bomb in front of it and just blowing it to hell. Because I don't. There's zombies, of course. I, just I mean, that yeah, that too. Now. No, bitch. <laughs> Boing. Ah, fuck you. <laughs> he comes up. <pfft>, no, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, buddy. Money, money, money. 